Fuck it, I'll explain it right now. Alright, so we do the setup to get into a specific position so that we can get a specific angle once we clip out of bounds on the Skulltula. And... We need to clip out of bounds here. For the camera to lock. No oh, shit. So right now the camera is fine. But now they're just locked because I'm out of bounds. And when this camera is locked, if you hold target and press C up and A on the same frame, you start a dive animation, but you're also going to C up at the same time. So you're kind of diving downwards, except you're not. It's right there, you heard the dive, but he didn't actually go down. And now if you go on a specific frame of Link, like bobbing animation here, um, you have one frame where you can move. It's this frame. You have one frame where you can move before the dive like gets to finish and you surface from the water. So right now you're still like diving down into the water according to the game. And since you never technically surfaced from the water there, the game now thinks you're like diving downwards. You can tell by the A it's on my uh, A button. Right? And if I pick up this deck in uh, underwater, technically, it's gonna wait for me to surface before it plays the animation for me getting it the first time. If I pick this up right now. And it's currently waiting for me to surface from the water. And um, what I can do from there is climb up here. And then for some reason when you touch chests in this game, it, I guess it like prepares you for giving you the item in the chest somehow. But it's not supposed to, that value is not supposed to be used for this uh, sort of like get item animation, I guess. So when you touch this chest, it overwrites the value of the item that the game is waiting to give you. So right now, if I surface from water, as you can see in my inventory right now, I have sticks and I have to the to the arrows. And then here, I get a glitch text box and an invisible item. If I pause now, bottle. And now we use this bottle to do the wrong warp so we can skip from the first dungeon to the last dungeon in the game. Or not the last dungeon. To the uh, final part of the tower collapse sequence after beating Ganondorf.